Choco Bucalina! Welcome, get your traveling products here at Chocolina's Emporium. The beauty's all mine, but the products can be yours, but only if you show me the money. This might be a once-in-a-lifetime choco-amazing opportunity, so don't miss out. Um, hi there. I'm a little overwhelmed and slightly confused, to be honest. So you run a shop? Chocolina! And stuff. Alright, let's do some selling. Um, I've got a whole bunch of these iron bangles I'm not using. So, uh, let's get rid of those. And not much else. I have a whole bunch of potions. Let's see, what can we get? Weapons. Azrael. Uh, meteor blades. For a second. Um, 25, 20. Not bad. So we'll stick with that. And Howling Soul. Okay. The... Have a fantabulous day! The Azrael is actually a downloadable content weapon, so uh, you have to buy that one. And I'm in the wrong spot. Alright, equip. And there it is, Azrael. And uh, Howling Soul. Uh, let's see. That's not really enough of a boost to warrant the HP loss yet. So I'll just keep going with what I've got. Have you seen that big old giant? Where'd he come from? Someone sure wasted their time and hard-earned money making something that big. I don't like seeing materials go to waste like that, but hey, what can I do? I can open up my shop! That's what I can do! Uh-huh. Can I sell? I still can't sell them. That's sad. So, uh... Sarah's gonna be a little overpowered for a bit. You know I'm counting on you. Everyone is! Okay. But I'm alright with that. <laughs> yes, I know I have to talk to you. Give me a second. What a unique little pet. Well behaved, too. Is he a monster of some sort? Not exactly. He's more like a good luck charm. Is that right? You're such a cute little boy! This city is several se- Yet based on our studies so far, Atlas is quite obviously from an entirely different time. So, Atlas wasn't born from the ruins. Exactly. It's as if it sprung up here from a completely different dimension. I've got my eye on you, don't you run off. It's my turn to cook today. Hope you're not a picky eater. Oh no, I'll eat anything. Thank you. Good to hear. You know you need to be able to handle anything in this day and age. Darn it. The provisional government is behind the academy 100%. I could have sworn that she was a quest. Can't let a little rain. Atlas has the ability to appear and disappear randomly. Its main physical component actually exists elsewhere. So if we want to defeat Atlas, we need to destroy that component. We can also try and figure out its spatial manipulation mechanism. I wonder if the Paradox has anything nah. to do with it. Alright, let's go talk to Alyssa. She's got a big yellow glowy thing over her head. That usually means something. You'll need an ID to travel any further into the ruins. Here, take this communicator and keep it with you at all times. You obtain the communicator. And a map. So I'm curious. Yeah? Just why are you helping us anyway? I saw you two. I saw how you got here through that thing. What? You mean through the gate? Yes. It is a kind of gate. It links to another world, doesn't it? Oh, boo. Nice to finally have some clue what these things are for. So basically, helping us out was almost like part of your research. But you still have questions. I do have questions, yes. About the gate, and about the paradox. Yeah. But with Atlas throwing his weight around, the ruins will be closed off and there goes the chance to get your answers. No. <sighs> no problem. Huh? We'll take care of that giant for you. Wait, what? You will? Great. 
Great. You really want us to go take on a great big old giant? Jeez, no. All right, you can change party leader. Three types of gates exist. The ones that shine like the sun have been blessed by the goddess and require special artifacts. Really? Uh, the crystal gates require wild artifacts. So you need pain, blah, blah, blah. The scorch gates are the ones most recently used to travel and you can return to the Historia cards for that. It's interesting. Okay, so we can change, le change leader. I'll stick with Sarah for now. And that's about it. Oh, I also, uh, one more thing. I have an outfit for her as well. I got this for free for uh, a, some survey, no, uh, a trivia thing that uh, Square Enix NA was doing, which I think is pretty cool. I'll, uh, I'll show this for now. Your ID checked out. Be careful in there. I'm just too popular. Five years ago, the Sanctum ordered the purge and drove people out of their homes. A lot of them escaped and fled. They hid in these ruins, hoping to survive. Uh, let's see if I can get a better view of her outfit for you guys. There you go. And now turn around. Thank you, dear. There you go. Why did you offer to stop the giant? Because we can't let Atlas shut this place down. We need to search the ruins. There might be other gates we can use. Like the gate to Valhalla? Exactly. And how can I take you to Lightning without those handy dandy portals? Right. We'll do it your way. Well, that dialogue was changed. Uh, I hear something. There it is. Alright, here we are. You require, you require some <laughs> potions. Item get! I know there's a, there we are. Alright, we have the Zorg Standard and we have the Ketchi, and we're going after the Ketchi first. Okay, we are way over leveled compared to where we were before. Oh well. Let's take him out. How much damage is she doing? 163, 143. Interesting. And there we go. Catchy, Zwerg Scandroid, and Potent Bolt. Paradigm Pack unlocked. And now interesting things what? happen. The monster turned into crystal. Servant of time, daughter of chaos, unto the world unseen, the untamed you guide. <laughs> what do you know? <laughs> it talks. Wait, what do you mean? Yeah. Guide the untamed? Your power over monsters, Koopo. Over monsters? Now that you mention it, Lightning had monsters fighting with her in battle. You can do the same, Koopo. Mm. Okay. This power, can you show me how it works? I want to learn how to protect myself. Might as well start now. Koopo? <laughs> No, I don't need a tutorial. I know how to do it. Monsters! Catchy. Swerg Scandroid. Okay, so take a look in the upper right. I was wondering what these meant in the demo, and I figured it out. Uh, late Bloomer, that talks about uh, its growth path. Since it says Late Bloomer, it can go up to about level 99 usually and you don't get much benefit of it out of it until really late in its development. Hexproof means that it's strong against uh, curses, you know, Saboteur roll, or it gets abilities that are strong that, you know, are against those. Uh, same with Thunderproof, it's strong against Lightning, or it gets abilities like that. Well-grown, uh, I think that means it goes up to like 40 or something. But I'm not really sure on that. So, uh, okay, the standard versus calm. Um, I can't remember off the top of my head. But let's uh, let's equip the Zwerg and the Cat Sheep. 
and change our paradigms. That looks good. And change this to catchy, catchy, catchy. Uh, commando, commando. Uh, let's set this down there. Diversity is pretty useful to have. Uh, let's see, aggression. Let's change this to cross as well. We don't have any wide abilities yet, so that doesn't even matter. The other thing we can do is um, Crystarium. And this is where you scan the road. And just start leveling them up. There we go. That uh, didn't go very far. But, anyways, we now have that ability. I don't know, I kind of like this, this outfit for her. I'm not sure. I thought I wasn't gonna like it, I thought it kind of looked a little stupid, but, uh... Not bad. That just happened. Onwards we go. Oh, he has a little talk bubble. disappeared into another world or another time, I guess. Okay. So now that that happened, let's take a look around. Okay. Um, in a little bit of editing magic, I don't know if you guys uh, noticed that or not, Too but easy. I've got a little monster buddy here that, uh, hey look, connected. that normally you wouldn't have. Let me just show you what I did. Uh, I kind of had to um, stop playing because I got interrupted. So I went back to uh, Nolan Sarah's starting home, New Bodum, and I just picked up a couple of little guys here. Just because I could. And uh, leveled some of them up. I'll show that all off later. Another gate, huh? Figures. And we need an artifact to open it, right? Right. Key. But for now, let's just beat up on some guys. So yeah, I'm a little over leveled than I should be, but uh, I was planning on leveling up a little bit anyway, so uh, there's another Chocolina over here. Hi Chocolina. If it's the giant you want to take down, then take a look around. Yay. Um I don't think I have much to sell. I suppose I could give Sarah that magician's mark. She doesn't really need the uh Bang. Iron no, Bangle. That's what the thing is. So, let's uh, do that. Equip. Magician's Mark. There we are. Now she's got more magic power. Uh, another thing you can do is change your leader. And I like Sarah better, so meh. Okay, people to talk to. Lots of people to talk to. Some of them have interesting things to say. Who are you? Oh, your name's Chester. We had some supply stations around here. Then they sort of disappeared. Probably another paradox side effect. Leave it to me, Koopa! Alright, so now you can hit RB. And Moogle will do things. Like this! I really wish they would have left that into the demo because I spent so much time trying to figure out what the frig I was supposed to do. You find a wild artifact. Cool. 